friends today we will be doing the ossesone test for reducing sugars sugars which are aldoses or containing hemiacetal on the anomeric carbon of the sugar is called reducing sugars ossesones are organic compounds formed when reducing sugars react with excess of phenyl hydrazine Ossesones are peculiar with each different reducing sugar. They have a characteristic crystalline structure which can be studied under the microscope. Materials required: the test solution, phenyl hydrazine hydrochloride in excess, sodium acetate, and glacial acetic acid. Start by taking 5 ml of the sample solution. Here I have one percentage glucose. You can use any reducing sugars like maltose or lactose. Into that, we will be adding five drops of glacial acetic acid. Care should be taken while handling glacial acetic acid as it is corrosive. Now we will be adding 0.2 grams of phenyl hydrazine hydrochloride. Use gloves while handling phenyl hydrazine. Now we add. 0.1 grams of sodium acetate crystal after adding all these compounds we mix the contents well with the help of a glass rod after mixing it well we will keep it in a boiling water bath for 25 to 30 minutes What is happening here is two separate reactions. Firstly, the glucose reacts with phenyl hydrazine giving glucose phenyl hydrazone by elimination of a water molecule from the functional group. Next step, one equivalent of glucose phenyl hydrazone reacts with two equivalent of phenyl hydrazine. That's the reason for excess phenyl hydrazine. The first phenyl hydrazine oxidizes the alpha carbon to carbonyl group and the second phenyl hydrazine involves the removal of one more molecule of water with the new formed carbonyl group of that oxidized carbon forming a carbon nitrogen bond. The alpha carbon is attacked here because it is the most reactive carbon atom. This figure is the complete reaction in a nutshell. Okay now we are back to the reaction after 30 minutes we take it off from the boiling water bath and cool it under running tap water we then observe the crystals formed under a microscope in high power field the following are the images which i captured using my microscope the needle shaped crystals indicate the reducing sugar is glucose or fructose In the next figure you see sunflower or petal shaped crystals indicating the presence of maltose and the last figure is lactose forming hedgehog or powder puff shaped crystals Thank you so much for watching my video if you loved the content of this video do subscribe to my channel and click on the bell button so that you will get notified about my new videos